In this video, I'm going to introduce some products of how to apply it into your hair to get nice, wavy, juicy, soft, curly hair. It really fix your dry hair. Just subscribe, leave comments down below, and don't forget to hit that bell so you'll be notified when I have more videos. All right, gonna wash this hair. This hair needs to be washed. It's very dry, y'all. So follow me in the shower of this beautiful wash day hair routine for dry hair. Yes, for my dry hair. And not only it's a wash day, I'm gonna be showing you guys all the new great products that I'm using and the gels and the conditioners that I'll be applying in this wonderful hair. Before I start my wash day, uh, just gonna massage and stimulate my scalp and rush blood flow to my head so I can get more faster hair growth. Yes, more length, y'all. I want more hair length. I want this hair to speed up its process. I want this hair to grow faster, and this hair will grow faster. This is a method that actually works. Just takes time to do it. But I'm not massaging it with my fingernails, y'all. Make sure you use your finger tips, not like the ends where the nail is at. And you hold it in place and move it around. Yeah. Shake that scalp around, stimulate that scalp, get that blood to flow. You can elevate your head if you like, that helps. Do a little shake, do a little move, get it to grow. So I did apply some of this Chocolate Kinks Curls, you guys. It's a coconut cream clay wash detox define shine. It just really enhances the hair with more definition and more shine and it just gives the curls that luscious, gushes moisture, you know, that you need in your hair. And look at that. It just feels so much softer. It's very thick and chunky. It smells great too. And it's organic ingredients, you guys. You apply it to wet hair, you massage it through your hair and scalp thoroughly and gently finger detangle. This is a lifesaver treatment to put in your hair first, you guys. I don't think I have mess, but it's up good. Cause you'll be seeing me getting ready. So yeah, made it a lot softer. It smells like candy, like chocolates actually. It smells really good, but it's very, very heavy, very thick. I wouldn't recommend this for somebody that has thin hair. This is like somebody that has very thick hair. Like for, you know, for A, for B, for C, all in that category. So this is what it looks like. It's very thick. Like, looks like a clay base. It's very, 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 very thick. This is definitely for somebody that has extremely thick hair. The second ingredient is shave butter, aloe vera. That's good, y'all. And it actually has clay in it and a lot of different types of oil and coconut oil argan oil and a lot of other good stuff so <laughs> so you see i put it in my hair already it defines some of the curls but i'm not leaving this in my hair i'm gonna rinse it out with warm water i'm gonna finger detangle it massage it in my scalp it's all organic, it's good stuff. I'll put the link down below, you guys. Enough said. Now let's rinse it out. Last but not least, I like to apply black castor oil on my ends, you guys, before my wash day. You know, I do the praying hands midway to, to the ends, and I'm applying like a really heavy amount, like a really good, healthy amount on those ends. Just bring back that moisture. You know, I want my hair to be so dry. Those ends are the hair, I mean, the part of your hair that gets dry the most because it's the oldest, you know, and you have to really take care of your ends if you wanna maintain your hair length. So just get those ends right. 
So I'm going to let this product sit in there for at least 30 minutes to an hour. And now let's rinse this out, this clay with this black castor oil. I'm going to do a light shampoo, the shave moisturizer shampoo. You guys, you can use either or. I prefer both of them. <laughs> I just love both of them. And so the conditioner I'm going to apply in my curly hair will be Kinky Curly Knots Today. It's a leave-in conditioner. So I'm going to make this really quick. My footage ran out on my camera chip, so I'm shooting on my uh, iPhone 13 Pro Max. I'm not used to it yet, so just bear with me. So uh, as I am classic curly gel, y'all, I already put the uh, coconut cantoon in the hair and stroked it. As you see, I didn't do this, but I did that back here already. So I'm gonna do this and show you guys. Split this piece in half, apply it when the hair is damp. The brush I'm gonna be using is this one. And I put a good healthy amount on my hair. And I'm just gonna glide it. I don't put it too close on the scalp. And I already brushed my ends, you guys, so make sure you brush your ends first. Before I got out the shower, I did apply more castor oil to my ends because I'm really trying to hold in that moisture in my hair, you guys. My hair just struggles being dry especially where I live right here it's just like really dry hot weather in Cali so gotta make sure I really take care of my ends so I already put the cash roll oil in there and product does so well you guys it does not flake in my hair I love it it's lightweight uh oh sounds like my baby woke up I better go get him so I'll just show you guys just put a little bit more in your detangle doing my whole head but I just wanted to show you guys that curl right there how the product and if I stretch it Sorry for the background noise. Uh, those are my kids in the bathtub behind me. I really just want to show you guys the finished hair product of like mixing these two products together. It does a perfect cocktail, you know, and how it's defining my curls. Um,
as I am classic curly gel, one thing I did realize with this, it makes my hair dry fast. You know, you know, I applied a lot back here and it's, the hair is already drying. And then the, where I placed the um, Echo Flaxy Gel, it's not drying as fast. It's more weighing the curls down and stretching it out. So the curls are not so defined, but it's more clunked together. But the As I Am Classy Gel, it's more fluffy and the curls are not so much clunked together. I think it's good to combine it. I thought I can just go ahead and write it out by itself, but no, this didn't work out by itself for me. All right, so yeah, I am putting that Echo Styling Black Castor Oil Gel in there because I need more of a hold, y'all, and y'all know how thick this is. This does the trick. So mixing it works good. Um, as you see, I put it right here. It's really defining the curl as like I put the as I am back here it's just very fluffy you know what I mean and, but it is drying my hair fast I do see that difference so just wrapping it up I wasn't really looking forward to um putting the echo black castor oil gel in the hair but it seems like it needs it because my hair frizzes up very fast and as I realized with the as I am curly gel it just was drying faster but it wasn't defining my curls and it wasn't clunking together like this so but i do like the ingredients in it so i'm probably going to actually just mix them together so this weighs down my hair because that's i like to stretch out the curls to show more length to get more of a like a wave so i highly recommend the echo black Castor oil gel, I just, you know, <laughs> wasn't looking forward to putting that in. I was really hoping I can just write it out and just go ahead and do the As I Am curly gel, you know, um, the curly gel by itself because I love the ingredients, but my hair wasn't having it. So I have to mix it together. So for you guys to not waste time on purchasing it, it's best to mix it together. And as you see, it is very liquidy. A little slimy but very liquidy i prefer thicker gel so so if your hair is a little bit more finer than mine it's not as thick as mine or not as frizzy as mine you probably can just go um and just do the as i am gel by itself you know i think you might not have to mix it i don't know sis but back here it'd be hurting <laughs> Oh, it just hurts. It's very tender back there because I just stopped wearing high ponytails. Did you know if you do wear high ponytails, it stops the circulation of your blood flow because your scalp can't breathe and it prevents uh, blood flow in that area. Oh, and on top of that, it actually can pull and stress out your edges because that hair is a lot shorter and it's trying to gather in a ponytail. These are only high ponytails. So I recommend doing a low ponytail or just don't even do a ponytail or do a loose ponytail or a loose braid if you really want limp attention. And that's the tip of the day, y'all. Because I'm not liking this too much right here. I'm liking more of this. And that's where the flax seed's at. This is where the as I am. But you guys let me know. Let me know with the comments down below, you know, what type of curl. You want more of a fro, fuzzier, puffier curl or more defined, like crispy, you know, stretched wave. I want to know. Caesar salad with avocado and fresh parmesan cheese that I love. 
back to this as I am classic curly gel um, I do recommend it because the ingredients in it is unbelievable it's really great um, does not flake up your hair I like that it's a great detangler has a little bit of slip but not enough for me um, I do recommend this you know it's affordable it's not too inexpensive but not too cheap I I'm happy with my results, though because I added my black Jamaican castor oil gel, echo gel, that really helped. But I think if I did this solo by itself, this wouldn't do it for me. But because the ingredients are so well, I'm going to make it work for me because I really want to go to a healthier gel. Like Kinky Curly Gel, that gel works good for me, but it's in a small container similar to this. So I'm just trying to find other, you know, items that I can use because I'm really replying back to the comments that you guys leave down below. And somebody did say they're looking for more products, more conditioners, more gels. For hair similar to mine, that is like a 3C, a 4A um, curl type, you know. So it is damp, but it's basically more dry than wet. And let me show you guys close up. this channel you guys I really appreciate it give this video a thumbs up and I will make more hair growth videos for y'all and we will fix and improve our hair that's right